The overall goal of this experimental procedure is to quantitatively isolate and obtain a highly purified population of the scarce CD4-positive V-delta-1 gamma-delta T-cell entity, which has been shown for alpha-beta T-cell progenitors. This method can help answer key questions in the field of extrathymic T-cell development about what initiates, drives, and modulates the induction of adaptive immune responses. The main advantage of this technique is that it facilitates the rapid and efficient enrichment of a scarce cell entity while maintaining the functionality, viability, and sterility of the cells. To isolate the PBMC, begin by diluting 50 to 100 milliliters of a freshly obtained human blood sample to a 1 to 2 ratio with PBS. Next, carefully layer 35 milliliters of the diluted blood onto 15 milliliters of cell separation gradient in a 50 milliliter conical tube, and separate the cells by centrifugation. After collecting the lymphocyte layer, wash the cells in PBS, and resuspend the lymphocytic pellet in 1 to 5 milliliters of a hypotonic buffer solution to lyse the remaining erythrocytes. Stop the lysis after 2 to 4 minutes by adding 10 times the volume of PBS. Then pellet the cells and wash them in 10 milliliters of fresh PBS. <laughs> 